Stop. Stop. Stop it, guys. All right. What? What is the? Take more. Take There's a new generation of internet stars, and I'm excited for them. They're getting all the attention now. I mean, all of it. They are. But what happened before fame? What do they look like before fame or when they were younger? How do they even get so famous? I mean, we know TikTok is huge right now and has been for a couple of years. So we're going to look at famous internet stars then versus now, before and after, exclusively on reaction time, guys. So let's jump right into it. Let's go. We got Charlie D'Amelio and Dixie D'Amelio. The D'Amelio sisters, actually probably the most famous stars as of right now. I'm sure every one of you guys know who they are. Now let's go back in time. Let's time travel backwards. All the way back when Charlie was an infant. This is actually Charlie, the famous girl you see today, back then. I think their age difference is like three or four years apart. But look, Dixie's already towering over Charlie, clearly. Oh, now I understand why she's so famous. Who doesn't love cake? If I eat cake, can I get some followers? Please. Yeah, my Instagram's Tall Fishman, please. You can tell she was a dancer back in the day. She was like born to be a dancer. And she got an appetite, a really big appetite. Maybe she was a Hannah Montana fan. Remember those glasses? Like people would wear those glasses. It's the best of both worlds. Charlie with Mama Charlie on her birthday. And like I said, dancer at heart from the start. Charlie's grandma kind of looks like Charlie. Is that surprising? Genetics. Whoa. Everyone tried that hairstyle at some point. I remember it was like a trend. Shave half your head. This is Charlie. I think this is middle school. Got the braces on. Just like a regular teenage girl, you know? Musically? Or is that TikTok? Back in the day, it was musically. I think this, she was doing some musically dances. Yeah. You guys don't even know, but I'm an amazing dancer. Let's put it side by side. You ready? You guys be the judge of this one. This is 2017 with the D'Amelio family. Her dad looks like he'd be one of my best friends. He just looks like so down to earth. He looks cool. You know, he's, he gets it. He's funny. And also, we both have this hairline problem. <laughs> Honestly, the D'Amelio sisters look like they were made to be famous. And Charlie, today, present day, now, we got more internet stars. Let's go. We got Avani, if you guys know who she is. She's actually one of the famous internet stars nowadays. Wow, my narration is amazing. I know, thank you. Duh. Staying the obvious. Born in 2002. She actually apparently started out musically, I believe, which is uh, before TikTok was a thing. And she joined the Hype House. That's what continued to accelerate her fame, but she originally accelerated into fame through her clown videos, her makeup transformations, like yeah like that not anyone can do that you gotta be pretty talented to be able to do that and of course a big part of it is dancing she's also a good dancer i feel like most internet tiktok stars had some dance component most of them are really good and that's why it just works so perfectly everybody wants to do whoa we got a little huddy one of the founders of the hype house the ogs how did he start off i feel like everyone kind of knows so you either have to be talented at something or a weird funny mix or just extremely good looking if you have all three then you're a tiktok god and the little Huddy is the TikTok guy. This is Little Huddy before fame. Check him out. This is actually a really good costume, not gonna lie. He's just an adorable little kid, all right? I wish I looked like him when I was a kid. I had a bowl cut. It's a beautiful hair, beautiful head of hair. Said mine literally put a bowl on my head and cut around it. Like that Jack in the Box commercial where they make fun of people with bowl cuts. And I was one of those people. It's not fair. We got one of the other founders, Thomas. He's like the in-house manager. The one who started the Hype House craze. This was him before. He was very hip. We got Alex Warren, famous on TikTok, also known as one of the best vloggers on the TikTok generation. This is him now. I want to see what he was like before. This is what he looked like. Wow. He looks like a classy man. Or in this case, prepubescent boy who set himself out to be famous. He already looks like he was ready to go. It's like, put me in coach. Can renegade better than any of these people. And that's a fact. No, I'm just kidding. Alex is not much of the dancer. He's more of the creative genius behind the skits, the scripts, the comedy bits. Evolution of Alex Warren, as you guys can see right here. Keeping it classy, as always. 
And of course, we can't forget Addison Ray. I don't know how these compilations found these people way back then. Maybe it's on their Instagram. I don't know. But this is Addison Ray as a baby. And for some reason, she already won as she was born. I guess just her existence into this world, she was crowned a winner. So it's like a foreshadowing in the future. I think she actually may be one of the older people in Hype House or used to be when she was part of it. Don't know if she still is, but you got Mama Addison and Addison down there knowing she already won. So why care? <laughs> She's laughing at the losers because she won. And the mom even knows it too. Okay, I'm totally kidding, guys. You don't need to have followers or be famous or be an internet star to win. You just have to be happy with yourself and uh, get millions and billions and trillions of views. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding, okay? This is when she first saw Musical.ly. She's like, I'm destined. All of these internet stars already looked like they were made to be famous when they were younger. So props to them, all right? Blessed with perfect genetics. Look, she's like, Hannah Montana wishes she was me. I'll show them. I was made for this. I think this is her in elementary school. This is her celebrating high school musical. <laughs> of course, we got more photos with the dad and the mom and me in the back, if you guys can see me right there. I know, I'm beautiful. And as you can see, my hair is missing there too. As always, nothing special. Oh, she was already in beauty pageants when she was younger. She was in beauty pageants and I would get bullied. I, I see how life works now. I get it. This is her younger brothers. Good. Asin is not a teen mom, okay? It kind of looked like that before I saw this little guy right here. But no, it's not. Now that's the family once they all kind of grew up. The evolution. Addison, when she is 16 years old, this is like three years ago. Now it's 17, only a couple years ago, or she's like 20 now, I don't know. You guys all need to help me fact check this in the comments down below. 18 years old, on her way to stardom, and 19. This is when she's already got TikTok famous, right here. And now, apparently, the Kardashians are taking her in. She's part of the Kardashian family, the mega famous. Nikado Avocado, he's like the mukbang king. Absolutely. And honestly, that looks delicious. After so many mukbangs, you just want to entertain yourself. Trust me. <laughs> uh, uh. James Charles is one of the most recognizable faces on the internet. This is the before. Yeah, that's nuts. That was insanitary, I don't think. Why would someone do this? Okay, in defense of James, he was trying to be like edgy, funny, and he just wanted to taste the Apple logo if it actually had an apple type flavor. I can guarantee you, I don't think it does. You can keep trying. Okay, what? Wait, who's that in the back? Is that? I have many questions and very few answers at this point. And this is James Charles now. Obviously, he grew to be who he is today. Another internet star, Trisha Pace. We're not going through everyone, obviously. Some people think she's extremely edgy. Maybe a little too much. Depends on your preference. Uh, yeah, I can vouch for that. What's going on? I don't know if this is edited in or not, but I definitely know that um, this is her transformation. This is closer to now. Obviously, this was a couple years ago. Some of this stuff. This is Trisha now. It depends. Do you like people when they're calmer or when they're edgier? Now, obviously, we're not going to get through all the popular TikTok and famous internet stars today. So, that means I want to see a part two, guys. Smash a like. Leave that thumbs up. Any comment that you want to see more before and afters of these internet stars. Because, like I said, there's still more to go. And, guys, don't be so harsh on me, all right? You only care about the internet stars today and that you stop watching me. And that's okay because the people that are leaving a like are actually the only people I care about. I'm just kidding. I care about all of you guys. But I'll see you guys soon. Have a great one. Follow me on the socials. It's all going to be right here. Until next time, see you tomorrow. And peace out.